Let's go toys. Action figure, dioramas, and props. First, let's start off with what you're going to need for this project. You'll need some sort of wood to stain. For me, it's going to be balsa and basswood on this. Then you're going to need some pre-stain or wood conditioner. I'm using Minwax. You'll need your wood finish or your stain. I'm using Minwax again. You're going to use these paint brushes and some paper towels. So I did forget to mention that I am going to be using sandpaper for this. So I'm using uh, 150 grit fine sandpaper for this. And I'm just going to do this lightly to get uh, the wood as smooth as possible. It's already pretty uh, in, a, in a pretty good spot. But I want to make sure that it's going to accept the stain as good as possible. So what I'm going to do is sand as much as I can in the grain of the wood. So for these beams on the top. I'm just going to sand a little bit going across. Okay, so now that the pre-stain is applied, I'm just going to wait about 8 minutes, and after that's over, I will go ahead and apply the actual stain. Alright, so the 8 minutes has gone by, and now we're actually going to do the staining. We're going to use this Minwax wood finish, um, and I chose this particular color. You can get different kinds. I got this at Hobby Lobby. You can get it at other places, hardware stores, things like that. Um, before I went ahead and uh, applied this, I did mix it off camera, so make sure you mix it before you use it. And we're going to do the same process where I'm just going to use these foam brushes and I'm going to apply it um, all over the, the wood. applied that pretty much immediately I'm gonna use some paper towels and I'm gonna wipe this off I don't want this to be much darker than what you're seeing so I'm gonna go through a couple of times and you can see it just comes right off and I'm going to wipe off all of the excess I want the stain to set into the wood not sit on top of it so that's what I'm gonna be doing I'm trying to go with the grain of the wood as best I can so I'll have to get another one. Okay, so now I'm satisfied that I've gotten as much of this off as I can. Um, and I'm going to let this sit for four hours. I'm actually going to let it sit overnight because I'm doing this late at night and I'll check on it in the morning. But I think four hours is the suggested minimum time. 
So here's the final product of the staining for this wood paneling of this arcade diorama that I'm working on. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please hit the thumbs up and leave us a comment. Let us know what other kinds of tutorials you'd like to see for your action figure dioramas. We'll see you guys in the next episode.